Anybody have clubs on Friday? I should get one. Art club. I don't think so. Is it art club day on Friday? Where is it? That's Thursday. Uh, art club's every day, but technically there is an art club on Friday. I believe there's a the music, music club. Yeah. Sorry. That's where yeah, Raph went last time to get his cheat. Right, yeah, I didn't think that had a so Cheat at the music Good. modifier. Good. Because yeah. remember, he asked Kahari to listen in. Mm-hmm. All right. All right. All right. Yeah. All right. I could have just got media club. All right. Anybody else? Or those the only clubbles? Okay. So I guess I'll ask people what they want to do. With those who don't have clubs. So who wants to tell me first? Yo, I'm going to Tokyo. <laughs> Rio's going to Tokyo. I need to find a man about a chicken. Little Rio in big Tokyo. <laughs> oh, good lord. Uh, Kara's gonna go talk with uh, the good doctor about her recent developments. Because that wise, I mean, she needs to go see him. So she can understand. Okay. And Ryu? Actually, in this particular case, Ryu needed to see the doctor as well, because he's kind of confused about what he pulled from the dragon. Oh, okay. And Reiko? Uh, considering... Well, I have the key for apartments, so I might as well make a surprise tomorrow. <laughs> just call tomorrow. So right now... Uh, I did remember that Phoenix might uh, do one thing, so basically find a nice secluded place or even go into Jeffrey and rent, no, rent, I think that's the word, uh, domain for like few hours to work on gates. Hey, you want to make some gates? Hi. Okay, so to give Ray a break, we'll do the clubs now, then I'll do Kahari last. All right. So, uh, media right, club. All right. I mean, Akira's gonna. I imagine that means she'll be walking with Suzuka there. Hey, Suzuka left first. I mean, bitch, I'm walking. I got long legs. So I'm gonna catch up. <laughs> what are you running? She's not running. No. All right. Akira's gonna catch up with her. All right. Akira walks in up to Suzuka. Suzuka holds her bag to her chest and looks at the floor as she makes her way to the media club. Akira follows. Alright, Akira follows her into the room. Good. And uh, you'll see there's people there and uh, you'll see Hamato's at the photocopy. Mm. And uh, he'll be like, uh, Hey, Akira, Suzuka. Yo. So, uh, well, now that the uh, the um, the exam annual, I don't know what it is technically. Now that that's over, I guess we need to decide what our new project's gonna be. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, we can't exactly be, you know. Yeah. Taking the break too fast, but I mean, we could at least spend a good day, you know, focusing on planning rather than diving headfirst into it. Oh, well, I thought that was kind of, you know, expected. Yeah, well, you know, I like to tackle things head on. I just wanted to say that let's not do that for in the immediate moment, because I have no idea what to do. I see. <laughs> that. That was your way of expressing your fears. Yes. All right. So um, he'll kind of look towards Suzuka and Kira and he'll be like, so I guess uh, brainstorming? I mean, when it comes to, when it comes to like school classes and stuff, um, I've got a pro couple of projects, but. Anything that relates to all of our subjects would help, right? Uh, right, right. right look, 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 yeah, fuck it. So, let me think off the top of my head because I don't have it on the top. I don't have it in my uh, immediate second. 
Do they have a class they all share together? I am checking. I, I put all the classes so. on top of the pages for the NPCs. Oh, nice. So, both, Akira, both Suzuka and Tomato are Japanese, but Akira doesn't have Japanese. Mm -hmm. Akira doesn't have creative arts either. Yeah. What are Akira's subjects? Uh, she's got two in athletics and then a psych, I think, and then business studies. Alright. So she doesn't she she doesn't share any subjects with um her mother. Oh, unlucky. Yeah. And her mother will think, uh, we don't really have a class all three of us there, so I guess uh, so I guess we'll go to a like a theme that can benefit all of our classes, kind of. Right. Yeah, I feel you. All right. He'll be like, I suppose the one that makes more most sense is psychology because you can kind of feed that into the creative classes. Yeah, yeah, you can always work it in somehow. I mean, you know, social stuff and all that stuff Sugiara talks about. Yeah, you can always find a good in for that. Say how the classes has an effect on the people or something. That sounds smart. All right, so we'll do something based on psychology, then. All right. Mm. Any suggestions, Jaku? Mm. I mean, we are talking to the person who got first. <laughs> mm. Well, what class would we want to focus on, then, with uh, the second one? I mean, yeah. we could focus on the class you guys are in. See how the subject's related to the psych. Well, well, Suzuka does photography, and I do, like, you know, my writing thing. So, mm. I mean, it works in naturally both ways, because you'll need to take photos and write the article. Right, right. I guess it could be, if we're focusing on the subjects like this, the evaluation of how the sort of different mindsets go into the different presentation of, you know, arts. She does like the quotation marks. I mean, creative arts is like a big catch-all for a lot of different professions, and there's a lot of different personalities and things that build into why people want to express themselves in that way. So we could kind of use the whole idea of how, I mean, already we've got you two with different things there. And focus on how the class is filled with a different lot of mindsets going to the sort of same general goal of expressing themselves. And how that, you know, shows in the students. Hmm. Hmm. We could interview some students, you yeah. know. Yeah, and exactly. It'd be like a bit of a profile piece on the different, you know, viewpoints of the school. And Shizuku will just kind of mumble, we can just go to a domain, that will be interesting. Mm. Oh, yeah, that could be fun. And Tamash will be like, yeah, right, right, because all of this stuff is to do with psychology. And it will mm. be interesting rather than just taking mug shots of people. Totally, totally. Mm. Do you guys know any that would be like a good place to go? I know Umberhop sometimes has job boards to go take things, care of things in the domain. So, I mean, if we found one of those, we could, you know, get a little side money and get some good, you know, shots. And Tomas would be like, yeah, like, we really do rely on Jeffrey, don't we? Yeah, eh, he's a good kid. I'm proud of him. He's really got the market cornered on this whole thing. Kid. Yeah, you I named him, you know this. I mean, I named this one of him. <sighs> and Tomato will kind of be like, uh, you do know about the uh, transport like hub, right? Uh, does it care? Hmm, <laughs> does it you care? You remember she's learned this at one point about Nexus? She hasn't learned directly, more like indirectly. So she probably wouldn't know the name. No. Transport hub. But she like, has been to the transport hub with the whole Ryu thing. Right. Like, 
transport hub is in the place you bounce around places. Wow, that was really vague and unhelpful. Uh, wow, when did you become Snarky Hamada? Uh, sorry. She jabs him but smiles. Nah, I missed it. No, but when it comes to when it comes to the transport hub, it's kind of like I believe the theory is because you go places like a domain to formed around it because it takes you to other places and well mm. the, um, So it's like a self fulfilling system. It feeds into itself. Right. It's more like a growth rather than, you know, anything ooh, else. Ooh, ooh. It's like a tree. It gets more branches. Uh Kira looks too proud of herself for such a bait, simple explanation. Yeah, I suppose. You could also equate the branches to like the rail lines like in Tokyo. Mm, even better. Nice. Mm. But anyway, I mean, I'll leave it to a vote, but we could either like go through Jeffrey. That would be a lot simpler. Mm. Or we could try and find one of the natural nexuses. Right. Well, yeah, what would you guys be interested in? I'm not really, you know, I'd be interested in both. Hell, maybe going for the natural way might be a good way to... Re hmm. Actually, hold on, I'm going to scratch that, because I don't think Akira would be like... It'd be good to remind people there are other things than Jeffrey, because Akira likes Jeffrey. So forget I was saying that. Akira will stop herself. <laughs> no, I, I just pretend I didn't say that to Fuck you. Oh. Anyway. Yeah. And Suzuki so will be like, I mean... I don't mind. Hey, looks like you're picking the motto. Uh, he'll kind of scratch his head and he'll be like, I kind of like the idea of, you know, doing it ourselves. Sure. I've never done it before, so it'd be cool. Yeah, we can always ask our hawkers for uh, advice. I mean, they have their own system and all. Oh, fancy. All right. Sounds like mm. a plan. I could ask Kanemaru, and unless you know any Humble Heart members yourself. Uh, no. Mm. All right. Well, there's also Fusai as well. She's, she's, a, she's a upper classman. Uh, Nakamatsu. No. <clears throat> Chicken chair? Chicken chair. <laughs> okay, it looks embarrassing. Coughs and goes, sorry. Uh, yeah. I heard about her. Uh, right. Forget it. <sighs> she just says, right, uh, let's talk to that Canberra guy. Oh, right. Yeah, he's uh, he's a he's a part of one C. You All know, right. wears the beret, has the really long scarf. Right. Do you guys want to look, get started now? Uh, he's probably not going to be here now. Oh, yeah. We could ask tomorrow. Yeah, sounds like a plan. I guess we can lay up the rest of the plans for today and, you know. Yeah. Right? Yeah, so both. I guess the theme would be Wanderlust then, if we're going to go out and, like, look for things. Yeah, 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 that sounds good. It's a fancy sounding name. You know what it means, Akira. I was just about to ask. <laughs> it's about that wanting to go out and adventure. You've seen that famous painting, right? The one with the guy looking out across the mountains? No, you haven't. No. Until... Sounds, no. Reminds me of my domain. He'll kind of tap stuff into his PDA and he'll, he'll show you the picture. You know the picture I'm talking about, right? I don't no. remember what it's called off the top of my head. Oh, no, I don't. Add mountain painting. Uh... Shoot. 
Do you know what it's called, Richard? Wanderer above uh, what? the Sea of Fog. Oh, this is it. It's on the fucking page. Yeah, the Wanderer above the Sea of the Fog. Yeah, that's okay, it. Okay, cool. Just checking. Okay, yeah. Kira, look and go. Ah, that looks like my domain. Oh. Right. Huh. I guess you would know something about that concept, and if that's like a domain you have. Oh, yeah. Huh. That kind of resonates with me. Yeah, I'm feeling this subject. Let's find some cool places to explore. I'm digging it. Hmm. Right, right. So I suppose we should just, you know, brainstorm. And uh, I guess everybody will, like, roll either their expression or their knowledge. Oh, no. Uh, I have, let me check, two PP left. All right. Expression D8, can I, uh, can I spend that my courage to make Akira sound cool and excited and be like, let's do this, let's see this. Do you want to sound it or like say... Emanate it. I mean, if you just want to sound excited, that's fine, but it won't like, it, it, it won't like, like give you more content, if you know what I mean, it will just make you like more confident. Yeah, that's what I'm going for. That's why I'm yeah. roll. That's why I'm, I'm just my reason for having a reason to spend for it. Okay. See, that's why. That's why. <laughs> All right. So Kim's really fucking getting into this. Yeah. She's letting the Wukong fucking. She's feeling let herself. She's... It's adventure. It's what she's about. How are those guys feeling? Looks like Shizuka's doing good too. Yeah, you're getting some good stuff out there. Is she talking? Like she's more like writing things down. Is is there like awkward avoidance of eye contact, or is she sort of chilling out and just talk? Or like, I mean, it's Shizuka, so she can fucking be a little weird and dodgy. But is she getting like? What I'm asking is is our is our fellow camaraderie overpowering the fucking I want to kill myself, stop trying to let me kill myself. <laughs> uh, she's still as awkward as before. Do, do you get what I'm asking? Yeah, it's not like she's like hee hee, friends. She's like, you know, okay. she's writing things down and she's mostly ref talking to Hamato when she's talking. Feels fucking terrible then. Alright. Yeah, but she's not like she's cringing when you're being super, like, hype and stuff. Uh, yeah, I guess that's a good thing. Small victories. Mm. Mm. So, you plan your, your little adventure. Mm. So, meanwhile, we'll go to Raph, and he's going down to the music club again. Well, they basically said, come on down whenever. Yeah. So you hear the toot toots and the boot groups. All right. Walks in. I guess. All right. Go. Uh, you take a scan around the room. I mean, Daichi's pretty fucking tall, so you're able to pick him out pretty easily, honestly. But figure he's pretty much surrounded, right? Yeah. yeah. Out of curiosity, are there um, sort of like um, a couple of other people with guitars? Like, sort of, is it basically all, everybody spread out, or are they sort of like instruments um, segregated, for lack of a better term? Uh, yeah, like, like, Daichi's with like the, the wind instruments people. You can right. see, like, there's, like, different areas, like, percussion, string, wind, and the other ones, I don't know. No, that's... Okay. You, you need that's... brass. Br brass. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. All right, so yeah. he's with the windies. Got it. I guess I'll go over with the... I'll go head over to the stringies. All right. So, uh, so I'll roll their gender. One is a guy, two is a girl. Oh, look, it's a girl. 
All right. So you go over to. Uh, <laughs> what was three gonna be? It was a one d one. You had a plus one. Yeah. So it's a two. So anyway, okay, how could it be anything other oh, than a okay. girl? I get it. That's the job. I just thought you rolled a one d two. No, we haven't basically mis misrolled before, so. <laughs> All right, so you'll go over. You'll see this. Uh, you'll see. You'll see this girl. Right, she has an electric guitar, and she'll be like, uh, "Hey, you lost or something?" Uh, no. Came here last week. A question: Has Rap been here for two weeks or one week? I can't uh, he's only visited once before. Okay. Right. Um, came here last week. I basically got this. As kind of an early, you sort of take the guitar off his shoulder as an early Christmas gift, and I'm trying to figure out how to use the thing. Oh, you're one of those people, huh? You're like, Daddy, Mommy, I want to learn how to play an instrument. And then you fucking abandon it like a puppy on the street, like a few weeks later. I know your yeah, types. Yeah, not me. Oh, <laughs> mm, not you. At least not for today. Mm. And she'll just kind of narrow her eyes and look at your freak guitar with, like, what? How many strings are on it? Four? Twelve. Twelve? Yeah. And she's yeah. like, uh, huh? Okay, twelve-string guitars are... Anybody who plays yeah, guitars would know what a twelve-string is. Yeah, it's a twelve-string guitar. I mean... Retard. Boom! I'm just joking. Come on. I yeah. called you a degenerate retard for not knowing what a 12 string guitar is. I'm being hyperbolic. I'm sorry. <laughs> I apologize. Yeah. I mean, one of the things I said is basically that it's, one, it's the hardest one to learn. So if anything, she can accuse me of if it's, you know, trying, to, trying too much or something like that. But the point is, One, yeah. Two sets of six. <laughs> You fucking counting them, Jesse, you <laughs> bastard. <laughs> and she'll you, just, be, uh... you just assume he's lying to you. <laughs> I don't believe you. Yeah. I actually did do a little, I did like, you know, the five minute Wikipedia read on him. Mm. I see. Yeah, that's better research than I've seen from some of my players. You ever played a guitar? Yes. Um, yes. I played actually here last week. Actually, it didn't do too bad, people said. You said you're a beginner, right? <laughs> I learned fast. <laughs> well, uh, listen here, kiddo. Uh, anybody could play a fucking guitar or piano or, I don't know, some kind of tin cans if they use their magic to do so. Uh, that makes sense, yes. I don't necessarily so you... have to use my magic. So do you want to actually want to learn, or do you want to show off? Actually learn would be preferable. Thank you. Mm. And you want to go acoustic, yeah? It's kind of what I'm going to learn on. If I go, I might go electric later on. I haven't decided yet. Is that I thing even better... have, does that thing can even plug into an amp? Mm, I will. Does it have an amp plug? No. Nope. All right. I'll give it here. Hand it over. All right. And she'll she'll take a look at it, and she's like, "Holy shit, dude! How much power are you packing in this thing?" Oh, uh, let's just use the strings as strings, to, shall we? And she'll she'll. I'm gonna have to put my glove on for this. And she'll put on her guitar glove, and she'll tentatively touch the string, and her whole arm will, like, experience shock waves. Okay. It sort of do make a move to, if, basically, does she sort of, like, release it or something, or? No, mm. it's, it's not like, ow! It's just like, okay. you, you know. And she's like, holy shit. And you want to play that normally? Yep. Do you have any other kind of strings? Uh, 
But, okay, um... We can just give you some if you join join the club officially and don't be a freeloader. I won't be a freeloader. I if I, I kind of assumed I joined last week because Daichi Boomers didn't have me sign anything or say anything. But if it's necessary, sure. Are you talking to that shaker? <laughs> yeah, he helped me out a little bit. I mean, Jesus the Christ, the guy's a fucking prodigy at guitar, but he keeps playing around with that, with that tin, with that tin cla- can cylinder. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, he does seem to like his flute. Mm. I mean, the guy's got a rock and roll soul, but yet he's pandering. <laughs> Maybe he's just trying to find himself. Mm. Find new challenges? Mm. Maybe he needs to find his fucking zipper. Holy shit. <laughs> Interesting comment. Anyway, so... What? I can't use the strings as strings? Unless I put more on? I mean, if you're gonna learn the traditional way, these ain't gonna work. Got it. You gotta pack out back. I can, I can, I can string it up for you. Uh... Jeff's question. Would unstringing it destroy my strings, or, I mean, how would this... No, it wouldn't okay. destroy them. But you wouldn't be able to use them unless you strung them back on again. Got it. Um... Damn. Alright, I'll... Yeah, if you could show me how to string and restring them, that'd be great. Because I kind of, for normal day, I kind of need the strings on them as they are. Uh, are you, like, trying to kill somebody with this or something? <laughs> no. Trying to make sure I basically don't kill anybody with it. Right. And uh, she will, uh, this, this, uh, this person, uh... Ashley, can you roll me a knowledge roll? Still stepped up because I'm in school? Yeah. What's your mother? <laughs> What's your mother I think it's a plus two at the best. Might be a plus two. Let me check. Okay. You mean with the school itself? Yeah, for my academy. Right. Yeah, it's plus two. So, 11 then, total. Okay, so this girl isn't a first year. She's a second year. She has, you can tell by her uniform, like all second years, they have like a slight, they wear like a different color to their tie. Got it. And then figure third years have a different color too. Yeah. And there shall be like, uh, right, right. Well, I'll show you what to do, all right? All right. right, watch closely. Then she'll roll an express with roll. She watch does it really closely, quickly. breaks out dice. She strings it really quickly. You find it really hard to follow. Uh, one more time, please. Really? Yeah. <sighs> she'll go again. <laughs> you get yeah. to nope oh my fucking christ oh I'm... my god is she's gonna storm off and be like fine i'll get your soy boy to do it and she'll you'll see her stomping off towards don't you Ugh. trying to read the directions on the pack <laughs> Alright, so you see in the distance some animated talking. And then Daichi will sling on over and he'll be like, <sighs> Sorry, man. Who is that, by the way? Oh, that's, uh, that's Suzuri. She's a second year? Yeah, you could tell. Wow. But anyway, I thought uh, I thought you were just going to stick to the trick I told you about. Actually, I 
forgot if the, what Tricky taught me. So, you know how the reason why you got your modifier? Uh, no, I don't remember what you're talking about. Sorry. Basically, he was like, "You don't have to learn. You can just use your magic to do it because you'll bring the same results." And then the next week, you're like, "I want to learn for you." So he's wondering why you are he are. So he's basically like, you're not just going to use the magic, the magic trick I showed you. Um, hold on a second. All right. I'm going to need people to help. Conf uh, I don't ever remember having ma uh, Raf say he's going to only use magic to learn something. If I did, then I did. But it, because he was, I mean, I'm learning it putting points into it and all that other stuff. So he is trying to actually learn it for real. So how is that split differently? Does anybody remember what I was going on about? Anybody? To be honest, not really. Sorry. Healer? Richard, are you still here? Nope. Richard? I guess Hey. I'm here, but I don't remember it. Oh my god. Ray, Ray went, went to FK, rather BIO. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Neb is BOB as well. Uh All right. not listed, but yeah, I guess he is, or he or his mic died or something. No, he'd type if his or mic was dead. Yeah. Alright. So anyway, I guess I guess you'll just we'll just be like you know, Raf got the wrong impression from Daichi then, or Daichi got the wrong impression from Raph. right. Okay. Sorry, I, just because I mean I it is something that you, you I was having him try and learn it for real because the joke is you know he'd be good at it just a lot better for boys than girls because he would put that modifier into it. Right. So. Okay. Maybe what it was was basically he he showed him how to use his magic to get over the first hump of you know. Complete novicehood or something. How about that? Mm, all right. Anyway, uh, I yeah. So I guess where does where do we restart the conversation then? No. Uh, okay. So that you'll be like, uh, uh, I thought you just wanted to know how to play the guitar. I don't think you actually wanted to learn how. Yeah. No. I. I actually. I mean, I'm gonna be carrying this thing around, and besides, I mean, it kind of. Some of my heritage sort of hints at the idea of basically, you know, playing these things. So I actually do want to learn this thing. You remember I told you it would take you years. Yeah. Yo, know, I mean, I guess that's where the magic thing came up with. Um, I'm I have no problem with taking the long route and the short route. Right. I'll put the time in. I'll take. I'll take the blisters, but if magic speeds it up a little bit, that's fine with me as well. And, and he'll just kind of scratch his head, and he'll be like, "You, uh, you're quite the special case." Thank you. I'll take that as as it was offered. Well, it's only because you're so cute. I'll say you how to string up your guitar. Yeah, I couldn't follow that. I, I mean. She was half in the way. Well, you know, she doesn't have the uh, longest of tempers, but uh, she does what she does rock the spikes quite well, don't you think? Oh yeah, she has her she has her own unique style. Mm. Mm. You into goths? Wait, what? <laughs> I'm dating Himiko. Ah, right. Mm. Yep. Just because you're dating one girl doesn't mean your eyes stop wandering elsewhere. Um, with this particular girl, I'm going to stop. I have to stop wandering elsewhere, otherwise she might kill me. Hmm. Uh. I believe they do have a special term for that in Japanese. But it escapes me. But anyway. I'm sure I'll be called it sooner or later then. 
All right. So he'll go very slowly and he'll show you how to do it properly. Got it. And you can hear the tapping of her foot behind you. <laughs> I try and pick it up as fast as I, you know, as quick as I can. Right, right. So you do know how to do it correctly now, right? Yeah, thanks. Mm. I just turn it back around. Sorry about that. Mm. And Maybe not the fastest, but I am determined. Mm. And the Dutch will be like, he has a lot of uh, energy, Senpai. You might want to break him in a bit, though. Like those oh, fingers yeah. of him, way too delicate. She'll just kind of grumble. Oh. Hey. Right. You do know your chords, right? Yeah. I know that. Pra practice the C one. Practice it. Do you want me to roll or? Yeah. Okay. It will be. Uh, it will be uh, expression. <laughs> Can <laughs> I add my mo my uh, guitar modifier? Your magic one. No guitar. What's your that? Uh. 20 or 220 and then probably tonight uh 330 uh where do you put your modifiers what page do you put it on it's on hold on it's uh crap nope where no Oh, the XP spent page. Hmm. Okay. Doc, I, I thought your guitar modifier was for like playing the guitar magically. Like when it when it comes to um, Wait, what? when it comes to Yeah, that's what I thought it was for. Like you've only had you've only had like one lesson of guitar so i just thought that was like you know it's sounding good because you were putting your magic into it not because you naturally know how to play guitar um i also assumed that basically the way it the way it worked with um using xp to raise skills and stuff like that that we our characters are like using magic to quick learn i guess is the best way to put it i didn't know that there was a separation between the two I mean, if you want me to slow down how much he's learned, I will. But I mean, the way the way it works with um, the way it works with skills, it's not, it's not like you're like suddenly learning how to do it. It's kind of it's kind of like well, your character has like a relationship with it in their backstory or something, or you're like learning how to do something that isn't like um, is it doesn't take as long as learning how to play the guitar. That's why I thought, like, the last time we had this conversation, like, Daichi was telling you how to cheat and actually play guitar. He wasn't, like, teaching you the normal way, which Raph wants to learn the normal way. So when I said it would take literally years for Raph to have, like, a normal guitar modifier, I did mean it. If you want to use, if you want to use like, magic and right. the XP system to learn how to played guitar you can do so it's just that raf said he wanted to learn the hard way well you question, what I'm my other skills like basically the math physics and world history is that magic enhanced or is that natural well that oh well, that's natural it's like i'm just talking about how long it takes to like learn how to play guitar because that does take years like reading on the subject and getting better at it wouldn't take as long as learning how to play guitar okay um uh, you can understand where um, I'm coming from, right? I get like if Raph suddenly just picked up a guitar, it's not like he's like, oh, I've always learned how to play guitar. Like he's like I'll he's drop being the point. accelerated. Oh. Yeah. I, hmm. I mean, if you want it I, to be like a normal guitar modifier, that's fine and all, but you kind of like like accelerated the process. Like I thought you wanted to 
like just do guitar things without the accelerated process? Okay. Uh, didn't realize that there was that much of a difference between the two. Now I do. So I mean, I'm just talking. No, no. About... I get what you're saying. I get how. I get the. It's it, it, you got the conflict of it. No worries. Didn't realize it there before. Now I do. No worries. Um, for the most part, basically, uh, Raph will keep the. I'll keep these at twenties, and I'll just mark them as mystical. We learned, and Raph is also trying to learn them the actual way, so he doesn't have to rely on his magic. Yeah, I, I kind of imagined in my head him learning naturally would just kind of be like social scenes rather than like like a justification for the modifier. Like if you wanted the modifier, you can like do your good guitar playing TM by using your modifier. You know what I mean? Uh, no, I disagree wholeheartedly with what you just said there. Um, okay, somebody else want to explain? Is anybody else I listening? Think that basically, he can use magic to basically speed up the process of learning, and basically, he can mystically play a guitar much better than you would with natural skill. And he'll yeah. also, and he's going to also be learning natural skill, which will be a different set of skill sets that will take a long time to learn. Correct? Yeah. Yeah, we're good. All right. Did everybody else understand? Is anybody Sounds else? Good even... to me. Okay. Yeah, it would right. kind of be nice to know which skills are mystically learned and which ones are not. Just well, to be aware I of say that. The way you think about this, unless you've got classes actually teaching you with this, and you're going to be doing them for any length of time, chances are you're probably getting like a mystical boost to that. So you're not really using natural skills. I mean, if you wanted to do something like take points into fighting with your uh, t the tone fuzz, which your character started off with. You could probably yeah. boost that really quick because your character's got background into it. But if, on the other hand, say your character instead wants to be able to naturally use a sniper rifle, it's not going to be as much because your character's not learning the natural skills. He's basically learning how to use his magic to enhance th what's there already. What? Yeah, it's a new thing happening. What's happening? Basic. Uh, skill Basic. progression has basically gone too fast. Oh, I hear, so we're... Oh, I hear, just, I hear just explanation. No offense, Dave. No, absolutely. Oh. GM wins. I just oh, want to hear it from the horse's mouth, though. You remember what happened in um, music class, like the music yes. class with Rap? Yes, yes, yes. And I actually said, I'm going to teach you how to play guitar, like to cheat how to play guitar, right? Yes, I remember. Yeah, I thought that was like playing the guitar like like with your magic, but yeah. it's written down as like actually knowing how to play guitar normally. That's why oh. I got confused. Oh, and yeah. Just... Back then I thought you were learning how to do like the cheat way. Yeah, that's what I thought as well. Okay. What's this discussion of magical learning though? Because I mean, okay, the reason that was like that is because you use your new ability, which is the whole substitute my magic die for this, right? That was why. No, it's basically it. As far as, I, I, I mean, uh, okay. What's coming? I, I, I'm just completely confused at this point. To be honest, fuck it. Well, I mean, that's not. Yeah. No, what okay. I'm trying to yeah, what I was what I was trying to say is that Raph is like, I want to learn how to play guitar, and I'm like, all right, do you want do you want to like? It will take years for him to learn normally. But he's got a plus two modifier where he's only played the guitar twice. So I was like, are you using your, are you like cheating to play the guitar? Or do you actually want to learn like a normal person would, which would take years? I wouldn't say it has to take years. Well, that's how it would work normally, right? Like, Not necessarily, depending on the person. Some people pick shit up really quick. I'd say if he's dumping XP in it, I mean, he probably shouldn't go to 40 immediately. But I'd say it'd be an excuse for him to start figuring it out. I mean, we're mythopoetics, right? They're supposed, yeah, that's to be, like... they're supposed to be people who have some very powerful expression. It just means that he's probably got an actual ta talent for picking it up. And he's like, hey, I never realized this. This is a good outlet for me. Mm -hmm. Have you never just done something in your life and realized, oh, wow, I'm, I'm, I'm understanding this. That's completely reasonable. I mean, if he did it for literally everything. Then it's like, you know. Yeah, I have, I have no problem with it being like a decent modifier if you like, you like, you're like you using the mythopoetic learning things fast kind of thing. Well, but no, I mean, I, 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 just, 
Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I, because I think you're misunderstanding what I'm saying. I'm saying just like as a person, like it's reasonable that mifo products generally have an inherent like them as people be uh, are generally pretty like focused either on one thing or good at getting down in like one fucking subject or something, and that's why they're mifo poetics because they're very powerful people in general. The idea of like naturally talented or something. Or, and so I think it's completely reasonable that it's be an explanation is that like, yeah, Raph could probably, if, if he say, if Dave's saying he figures like this would be something Raph would pick up as long as he's doing the XP and not immediately doing it to like a fucking ridiculous degree. I mean, yeah, why, why couldn't he just be learning the guitar? I mean, at the end of the day, I gave, I basically said like, you guys are the best judges of your characters. I just took what you said really literally, like he wanted to. There you go. Yeah. yeah, so it's just miscommunication. Uh, right. All right. So what is the end verdict here? I mean, from my personal perspective, you've like played guitar twice. Like if you wanted to be like Raph is just really that good at playing guitar that he has a plus two when he's only played it twice, then that's your call. I just got I just thought you wanted to go slower. Oh, the thing is, I feel is why he's probably doing that is because the point we're at is suddenly like 100s become what you have to reach to do good. I mean, it DCs depends. are pretty depends. jacked for I most mean, activities. And yeah, I know it depends. I, I know it de No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. Jess, I'm not going to put this on you because I'm about to explain what I'm fully saying. So don't think I'm done saying it. And that's because we're mostly doing things where they are very difficult things. They aren't like, I would like to go play a checkers match against a nice grandma at the mall. It's uh, it's not, I would like to strum my guitar with my friends. We're used to being, I would like to strum my guitar to save fucking humanity. So the DCs have generally been pretty high. So I'd express that you probably don't, if you're worried about having your guitar skill be good, just having the 10 means your character has something there. And since it's just playing guitar, until you're saving the world with it, you can probably get away with a 10. It won't be as high DC as you're used to because we're not, we don't do a lot of mundane shit these days. Yeah. A normal guitar roll might just be an expression roll these days. I mean, yeah. Yeah, like if you you're just playing for like casual, yet. like, I mean, Raph can play fucking Wonderwall on his guitar. If you wanted to be like super serious guitar man, then, um, you know. Like more mytho poetically, I think Ray explained it better than I did. Uh, yeah, it's not uh, just magic bullshit. Is basically the thing. I think, but I think the reason Jess was confused is because she thought you meant magic bullshit. <laughs> I need to be right back. Oh, okay. No, actually, bathroom. Uh, yeah, yeah, nature, yeah. I believe, so I believe it's you. Forced, yeah. Sorry. Okay. Mm. Hey, Jess. Wow. I think you made it sound like he was getting sh that you, you sh I think I, I get what you were saying, but I think he was just worried because it sounded like you were shitting on him. I just thought he wanted to like learn like a normie. Learn like a normie. Yeah, I think that's what he's saying. Yeah, but he wants to be normal. Yeah, but I mean, I could also see where Jess is saying that having like a plus 30 when you've played it like three yeah, times. I, no, I agree. I agree. I agree. I would just say I agree, and I don't think people should magically be good at things. But I also think if we're just assuming people aren't being retarded, we can trust them with that. Once in a while being like, hey, I'd like my character to be good at this. But I get where you're coming from. But I just wanted to... Uh, try and see what everyone was thinking. I wanted to mediate. I wanted to see from Mr. Dave, who's used to the very difficult DCs, that he uh, shouldn't worry too much about playing guitar because that DC probably won't be that high. I always thought it was just going to be like a hobby thing. Oh, I'm just going to yeah. play some guitar. It's not like play the guitar to save a demon from chopping your head off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But clearly he <laughs> wants to do it. So, I mean, yeah, yeah I'm kind of getting that vibe now. Let him, yeah. let him fucking level it up a bit, but just give him the ropes. Yeah. Give him the rack. There you go. Mm. Yes. Yeah. You just, you know, it's like, like I would like punch myself in the face if I suddenly gave Max a three out of thirty, you know, uh, 
painting modifier. Like, where the fuck did that come from? Yeah. 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 So, anyway, I should probably see if there's any dinner, because I haven't eaten anything all day. So, And it's 9 p.m. nearly, so when Dave comes back, say I went to forage for food. All right. Okay. All righty. I'll imagine your cheeks are bulged with nuts. Is it like a break time? Sorry. Sounds like it. 